Hey guys, uh, this is Nirmal here for Technic and today we'll see some of the best uh, launcher apps for Android phones, uh, the 2014 edition. So if you have been a U Android user, you might be already knowing what launchers are. So these are apps which allows you to open different apps which are installed on your device, categorize them and also making uh, responsible for making your device more user friendly and uh, get the better out of your device. So there are quite a lot of uh, launcher apps available for Android and one of the most powerful features of Android is the amount of customizations you can do with the device be it with themes, uh, icons, wallpapers, uh, roams etc. So launchers give you additional features um, uh, you can customize your phone uh, in the, in, with respect to the icons, uh, change them, set with new wallpapers um, and then also uh, categorize the apps, uh, icons, etc. So uh, we'll cover the best launcher apps which are currently available for Android phones. So you can try them on your phone. So uh, these uh, launcher apps which we are going to cover are the most popular ones and are uh, recently released. So we won't cover every one of them. Uh, we'll cover the best ones uh, currently available and uh, which are the least just as well and which offer more, more number of features with respect to the customization, etc. So, so we have picked uh, five of the best launchers available for Android phones, and we'll cover each of them one by one. We don't, we'll not go in into in depth uh, details of the launcher. We'll just show you the launcher and uh, the user interface and the amount of options available. You can go ahead and install these uh, launchers on your phone and try them. So we'll uh, have a quick look at uh, the five top launchers. So first step on the list is Nova launcher. So we have the Nova launcher right now. Uh, installed on the device so you can see this launcher in action so we have uh, imported uh, you can import uh, the settings from other launcher so we have imported it from the google now launcher so you can see this is the uh, nova launcher which we have right now available so you can uh, get uh, quite a lot of customization options from nova launcher and it's one of the most popular launcher available uh, uh, for Android phones. So it's a performance driven and bug free launcher which works uh, flawlessly even if you have opened lot of apps at any given uh, time. So major features uh, include availability of different themes, uh, a transparent notification bar, availability of icon themes, uh, support for Go launcher, customizable app drawers, uh, folders, uh, availability of folder icons, widget of overlapping features. Um, so there are quite a few uh, options available but some of them are uh, only on the paid version but uh, you get a lot of features even in the free version so you can uh, get them uh, get uh, by downloading the nova launcher so you can see here uh, this is the launcher setting so you can see quite a lot of settings available including uh, you can see desktop uh, drawer dock uh, uh, folders uh, look and feel so you can customize virtually everything on your device including uh, icons folders uh, look and feel uh, the gestures you can see uh, you can even back up and import your settings so this is uh, one of the best uh, launcher apps uh, available so it's available both in um, free version as well as the paid version paid version does come with a few a few other additional features but even the free version is really good uh, launcher for your android phones so second on the list is a8 launcher so a8 launcher was uh, released um, in the second half of 2013 and it went on to become uh, one of the popular uh, launchers for android phones although it's uh, right now available only if invite uh, with the invite so you need an invite code to try this out so recent um, recently a8 launcher was acquired by yahoo so it's now a property of yahoo but uh, the best feature of uh, this app is it's very simple and it uh, categorizes the apps based on their uh, functionality and groups them and also have uh, different profiles to manage so this is the home screen you can see uh, the frequently used apps are listed here you have a few options here quick options here then uh, you have this collection so collections are actually set of a uh, group of apps which uh, which have been categorized automatically by the app so you can see here uh, social is there work uh, settings uh, music uh, then uh, games etc so these are categorized automatically and you can even uh, uh, change uh, the apps from here so you can add apps to this and uh, finally there is also an app drawer so this lists apps according to the alphabetical order so you can search them uh, from here so you can see here this list uh, this um, categorizes based on the alphabetic order and uh, you also have uh, the spaces spaces are different uh, something like a profile so you can switch between profiles say for home you have this uh, then you have work so you have the work apps uh, listed here 
and if you are going somewhere you have the mapping application listed here so this is based see these profiles are based on what what you do on the phone or what you do so if you are an office uh, email uh, the calendar etc are more more important for you than other uh, say like games but uh, when you are at home uh, of, uh, these games and other settings comes uh, handy so it categorizes based on uh, which profile you selected and it the everything is done automatic so avid launcher is a brilliant uh, launcher app for android phone it's again free of cost but you need an invite code to try this out so if you have the invite code for avid launcher you should be trying out this um, launcher it's one of the best uh, launchers with the minimalistic uh, ui and uh, quite a lot of uh, features so next step on the list is uh, buzz launcher so buzz launcher is another popular android uh, launcher and uh, unlike other uh, normal launchers this does not have a core android look so it has a totally different look and uh, you can uh, there are quite a few options like you can set uh, different wallpapers uh, for each uh, screen you can resize icons uh, and make them transparent uh, designate different grids for each screen create folders in app drawers uh, and then change icons modify folders resize them uh, then you have um, glide up glide down and tap uh, double tap and more so these are some of the features uh, available on um, uh, the buzz launcher so it's it's a, another popular uh, launcher you can see here this is the uh, basic look you can see the icons are totally different uh, from the core android uh, icons so you have uh, uh, different widget supports you can download them then uh, you can see this is the app uh, drawer you have also have widget support and then uh, you can uh, you can view all the list of apps from here then the few settings available here you can see the frequently used apps uh, recently installed apps uh, then uh, you also have uh, options to create new folder hide apps manage them so uh, this is a very handy i mean uh, feature rich uh, launcher app uh, for your android phone and you can customize virtually everything on this device so you also have quick options like uh, app drawer wallpaper screen so uh, then home pack bus you can install download and install different home pack bus so these are um, uh, different themes for your home screen then you have the system system settings as well as the bus settings so this is another uh, free app uh, you can download from the play store and uh, check uh, check this um, launcher so it's again a very simple but yet uh, highly customizable uh, launcher for your android phone so next step on the list is bazooka launcher so again this is another popular launcher uh, with uh, quite a lot of options um, uh, and uh, it's it's fun to use kind of launcher so uh, just like other launchers in the list uh, this one uh, too is uh, very light on your smartphone it's lightweight and uh, it's amazingly fast it comes up uh, features like download and install themes uh, then uh, you have a support for gestures uh, then you can also select uh, home screens uh, and lock screens as well so you can see there's a cool animation when you switch between uh, uh, the app list and also go back to the home screen so this icon so you can see the different home screen so you can even customize the lock screen as well and um, uh, there are quite a few options as well so the icons are totally different from the core android and you can see it has a it's a fun to use kind of a launcher so uh, you have a lot of settings available here so just uh, we'll just check out the settings as well so this is the bazooka settings so you can see home screen drawer dock uh, general gestures so there are quite a few options you each each of them have uh, different options so for home screen itself you can set the grid size home screen um, number of home screens required default screen then search bar is there hide icons so transition effects so lots of uh, options are there you can even uh, install themes uh, for this uh, launcher so again this is a free launcher uh, you can um, get hold of this from the android play store and download and install them on your um, android phone and the fifth one on our list is uh, smart launcher so this comes in uh, two variants one is a free version as well as a paid version so this is again an immensely popular launcher app uh, for android phones and uh, just like uh, the nova launcher so it comes with the uh, cool features um, and it's also minimalistic uh, in interface and also low on resources so you don't have to worry the launcher taking up huge memory so you can see this is the uh, home screen and you have a few options here so these are the uh, frequently used uh, um, options so this includes camera phone uh, music uh, browser photos etc and uh, apart from that you have this uh, option here so this uh, is a app this is the app drawer so it categorizes the app similar to the aviate launcher you have communication internet games 
media utility and rest all the apps so these are the options available for uh, smart launcher so again it's a really uh, good uh, launcher app with minimalistic features as well as uh, low on uh, system resources so you can try out this launcher so you can um, you can you can categorize apps uh, uh, based on their usage then um, then you have customizable lock screen warp live wallpaper support and uh, there are quite a lot of features available on this uh, launcher app as well so this again comes in two variants uh, free and paid uh, obviously the paid version has a few other options which are not available in the free one but uh, it does uh, have uh, quite a few options uh, and uh, customizable uh, themes and wallpapers so th those are the five um, um, best launcher apps for Android. So we'll uh, list uh, the ones again. So first up on the list is Nova Launcher. Then you have uh, Aviat Launcher. Then uh, you have the Bus Launcher. Then the Bazooka Launcher. And uh, finally the Smart Launcher. Apart from that you also have uh, the Google Now Launcher which is available only for KitKat phones as of now. But uh, what you can do is you can um, uh, download the APK and install it. Uh, so that's uh, one uh, good uh, option. Uh, if you if you want uh, the uh, standard uh, android launcher so you can download this uh, from the description uh, below the links are available in the description of this video so you can get uh, these launchers uh, by using the description so this the these are the best five launcher apps for 2014 so if you like them uh, hit the like button uh, subscribe for more videos like this and uh, finally thanks for watching this video